have the biggest shark research project in the world underway in South Africa. We have over 30 scientists, 15 different research programs, over 10 different institutions, all working together for the resource and for the sharks. Boatyard was phenomenal. We, we literally did a, a refit on the vessel that should have taken us six months. We counted it into eight weeks. It was uh, hectic and stressful, and we had a lot of help from a lot of people. And basically, every system you can think of on this boat just went through uh, just for this crossing, just for this trip down here. It was a tremendous amount of work, and really glad it's over. <laughs> As a marine biologist, this ship is a pinnacle. You can't get much better for a research platform for this. This is the top platform in the world. Down here in Cape Town, and, and not in just Cape Town, but South Africa, this area, this region that we're fishing in, and working in, and doing the science in, it's got phenomenal weather challenges for us, and we're pushing our equipment just absolutely super hard. And, and when you're in these hectic situations where, you know, we gotta run, we gotta run, we gotta run, you hit those buttons, and boom, things are going with these cats. Everything works, and it's, it's an amazing feeling for me. As far as electricity goes, we actually have two generators, um, both Caterpillars. One's a 4.4 and one's a 6.6. .6. One's 99 kW and one's 125 kW. And basically this gives us all our electricity, just like at home. We have to be completely self-sufficient out here. So without a solid electric base, you know, you're kind of in trouble. And that's all taken care of now. As far as propulsion goes on the boat, we have two Caterpillar 3412s. And these engines are commercial duty and just bomb proof. We, we couldn't have done it without the repower. We couldn't have done it without the new cats. It's kind of a dream come true, you know. There's a lot less uh, antacids being eaten on the boat and everyone's just in a lot more relaxed mode. We can focus in on fishing, focus in on the science, focus in on the things that we came to do rather than having the stress of mechanical failure and things like that.